Hi guys, it's Alice and today I'm going to do the international booktuber tag. So this tag was originally created by Daniela in Prague and I was tagged by Teresa from the channel Ivy Muse, both of which I will of course link to down below, both their videos and their channels. I really like this tag, I feel like it's such a cool idea and I haven't really had time to watch a lot of people's videos yet but I'm definitely going to because I want to discover more fellow international book nerds. Anyways, we've got about nine questions I think and the first one is where are you from and what is your native language or languages? So I am from Norway and my native language is Norwegian. The second question is, in what languages do you read books? As I'm sure most of you are aware of, unless you're very new, in which case, hello, I read most of my books in English, although I am trying to incorporate more Norwegian books into my life. The third question is, is there booktube in your native language, and if so, what is the community like? I actually don't really know. There isn't one as far as I'm aware of. If any of you watching know of any, please let me know because it would be cool to find some because I don't know of any. I feel like I may have been recommended some in the past, but I think I might have forgotten to check them out. The fourth question is, if there is a booktube community in your native language, why did you decide to join the international one? So when I started, all the booktube channels that I knew about were either British or American. So that was the community that I knew about and I kind of wanted to see if I could join them. And it also felt pretty natural because I did already read all of my books in English. I also did it in part because I wanted to practice and maintain my language, which is one of the reasons I started to read books in English instead of Norwegian in the first place. Norway is also a pretty small country and not a lot of people speak Norwegian, so I felt like I could reach more people if I spoke in English. And I feel like I have, like I don't regret it at all, because it's so much fun to get to talk to people from all over the world about books. Question number five is, are there any struggles or challenges for you as a non-native English speaker? In the beginning, I did struggle a little bit with the actual language and having to edit my own videos and hear all my own mistakes. Like, it really bothered me. But now, it's gotten a little bit better in part because I've had a lot of practice and I don't really care that much anymore if I say something wrong. I do sometimes struggle to find the exact right words and I do have to in part script my own videos because I find that if I don't do that I either use forever to get my point across or I don't get it across at all. I've also found now that my channel has grown a bit and I'm very lucky to be of the size where I get free books. It very, very rarely works to request a book because they don't want to send them all the way here, which is totally fine. It only ever works if they email me and ask me if I want a book, then they're okay with sending it. It's not really a huge problem and I'm lucky to get any books at all, but I imagine it would be easier if you lived in the UK or the US. Question number six is how do you get hold of English books? So most of the bookstores in Norway usually have an English section, but it varies very much in size and usually they only ever stock the most popular books, which I totally get. But for me, I read a pretty wide variety of different books, so the selection in actual bookshops are usually too narrow for me. So I usually order my books from the book depository or an online Scandinavian shop called Oddlibris, who stock a variety of different types of books in all kinds of languages. Question number seven is, what is the best thing about being a part of the international community? You can answer this in your native language and add subtitles if you want to. Jeg kan godt snakke litt på norsk, jeg. Jeg nevnte det litt i sted, men jeg tror det jeg liker best er å kunne få snakke med folk fra hele verden og høre hva alle andre leser og hva de tenker og føler om bøker som man snakker om. 
Jeg synes også det er litt gøy å kunne gi litt innsikt i livet mitt her i Oslo og norsk kultur, noe veldig mange er ganske interessert i. Selv om jeg kanskje ikke er så god på det som jeg burde, spesielt når det kommer til litteratur, jeg burde seriøst lese flere bøker på norsk. Det er ikke helt bra. En bok i året, eller sånn. The second to last question is, do you watch other international booktube channels? Shout out a channel that you have found recently. I do not watch enough international booktubers, I have to say. But one that I've been binging lately is the channel Ivy Muse, which is the channel that tagged me to do this. I don't know how I missed this channel, but I love it. I'm also going to try and make my way through all of the people that the original creator, Daniela, tagged in her video because she had quite a lot of them and I hadn't heard of any. Ooh, one international booktube channel that I really like is The Bookish Land. She's Chinese and she talks a lot about Chinese books, although I don't think she lives in China anymore. I think she might have moved to the US. She's really cool though. The last question is tag your fellow international booktubers. Well, since I am a dork and I barely know of any of the people that I do know about, I have found it through this tag and They've already been tagged, obviously. I don't really know if I have a lot to contribute with. Maybe the Bookschland? Maybe you want to do it if you're watching and you haven't done it already? I always feel really weird tagging people for some reason, but if any of you are watching and you're international booktubers, please do this and send me a link so I can find you. <laughs> okay guys, those were all the questions. Like I mentioned, I will link to everyone that I've mentioned down below. Do go check them out. And also, let me know who your favorite international booktuber is, and I will see you soon. Bye!